the moment we are born as human beings, somehow our lives got complicated. If we had come here as any other creature on this planet, life would be very simple, eating, eating, sleeping, reproducing and dying one day. Now we have to do all those things but after doing all those things we find somehow it's not enough. Isn't it so? Yes? Once you come as a human being, Somehow, all these are compulsory in many ways, people have to do these things, but these processes of survival, even after they are complete, somehow a human being is still not complete. He wants to be something more than what he is right now. This longing is endlessly going on, finding expression in so many different ways, but all the time human being is in pursuit of something more than what he is right now. Somehow where you are right now, wherever you may be, is not enough. You want to be little more than what you are right now, isn't it? Isn't it so? If you know only money, maybe you are thinking of little more money. If you know only pleasure, maybe little more pleasure, power, little more power. Whatever it may be, whatever your currency may be, but uh, everybody is wanting to be little more than what they are right now. The process of desiring is continuously going on. So this longing of well-being, because ultimately everything that you are doing is in search of your well-being. Whether you are going to work or you are going to the bar or you are going to the temple or you are going… you are getting married or you are having children, you are studying in a university, everything is fundamentally your well-being, isn't it so? Yes? Different people may have different ideas about well-being. Somebody thinks if they can eat twice a day, that's well-being. But somebody else, that's not well-being, isn't it? Our ideas of well-being may be different, but every human being, consciously or unconsciously, constantly in search of his well-being, isn't it? <laughs> 